jimela maro aro aro jimela lori aye wa o baba ibi anu re bai wa de o aro jimela maro oni duro wa e se o agbejoro wa o e mama se o baba to ba se niyan lo duro ni wa ti ma so bo se niyan lo duro ni wa ti sa lo bo se niyan lo duro ni wa ti ma si ni gun ala nu wa e se o you are welcome to our channel God bless you. This morning, okay, our names are Pastor Mrs. Uh, okay, Pastor Mrs. Mary Omoboyega. And my own name is uh, Pastor Yemi Omoboyega. We are here before the throne of God Almighty this morning to thank him for everything that he has done for us in our thank family. You, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Our mommy turned three scores yesterday on thank planet earth we are not taking anything for granted and um, we appreciate you oh lord for everything you've done thank you every one of you that have been pat uh, patronizing our channel thank you lord. Uh, we appreciate you for being with us always thank you lord. Uh, please endeavor to join our family devotional everyday family devotional they are all there for you Thank you. Just Lord. click hear me Omoboyega. You will see in your, your YouTube, you will see us there always. Thank you for being with us. Please share our videos and let it be well with us. Thank you. Lord. And it shall be well with you also in Yeshua's name. Amen. Now <clears throat> the topic before us this morning is a or the virtuous woman the virtuous woman and um, uh, i am happy this morning that i'm giving a testimony concerning a virtuous woman that the lord has given to me um, for going to 40 years now i will give glory to god for all our accomplishments he brought us together and it has all been well and yesterday the 18th of september we celebrated her um first of all we want to thank god for her life let us pray anyway let us pray heavenly father we just want to thank you, thank you. we appreciate you for this short video we're about to do thank you. we thank you indeed for we are so glad as to come public and to say thank you before the very eyes of the entire world. Accept our thanksgiving in Yehoshua's name. Amen. We thank you, Almighty Father, for both bringing us together, and we thank you for the great things you have been doing, even in our lives, ever since then. Thank you for every step of our marriage you have been with us. Thank you, our journeys you have been with us. Over the wonderful children you gave to us, you've been with us. Thank you, Over Lord. our careers, you've been with us. Thank you, Over every endeavor of life, you've been with us. Thank you've you, never Lord. allowed us to be put to shame. Uh, you've never allowed our enemies to triumph over us. Thank you, Accept Lord. our thanksgiving in Yehoshua's name. Amen. Daddy, we appreciate you for the wonderful children you give to us, biological and non-biological. We thank you for members of our families who are so happy as to join us in celebrating your daughter, even yesterday. Thank we you. We appreciate you for every other thing that you, the Lord, has been doing in our lives. Thank you. May your holy name be glorified in Yehoshua's name. Amen. As we share our testimonies, O oh Lord God Almighty, I pray this shall not be the last one. Amen. In Yehoshua's name. Amen. Thank you, blessed Father. Thank you, we Lord. remember our iniquities as a couple and as individuals. Please forgive us in Yehoshua's Amen. name. Amen. Thank you, Daddy. Thank in you. Yehoshua's mighty name we have prayed amen um honestly speaking i don't know where to start from but let me start by thanking god as we uh, have 
already sung earlier uh, on behalf of my beautiful wife, my adorable wife, my humble wife, my better half, and um, who celebrated her 60th birthday yesterday. It was marvelous. It's not a left to me or left to us. Indeed, her being on camera is something that took, we have to debate first because she doesn't like publicity. That's the kind of person she is. But I just have to let her, this time around, we just have to come together. And I want to say this woman is a wonderful woman. I am her husband. Uh, I'm so proud of her. And I thank God that my expectation, you know, did not fail over her. Because the journey of our lives has been a journey that the Lord himself has piloted. And it has been wonderful. Today, I'm happy. She's uh, Yesterday, I'm happy that she celebrated her uh, 60th anniversary. Climbing now the ladder of the 70s. And as the Lord God Almighty lives, she shall get there. She shall get to the 80s. She shall get to the 90s. She shall get to 100 and more. And as much as as many more years as she wished. In Yehoshua's name. Now, <clears throat> this woman, I cannot go into the history of how we met. I've told part of it severally. She's a woman that is... Some is somebody to be proud of. Just if you want to know the kind of woman I have that God gave to me, please, you may have to go to the book of um, Proverbs chapter 31. Sorry, let me put on my cap. Uh, you may have to go to the book of Proverbs chapter 31. Everything that the Bible described as a virtuous woman there, she is everything. Then you may also go to the book of Ruth, Ruth, um, chapters 1 and 2, or even the entire Ruth. Ruth, when she married, she did not marry her husband alone. She married her husband, she married her mother, she married her, everything in the house of her husband. That when the husband died, she still remained, and today she's uh, recorded in the book of life. That every quality that um, Ruth had, and I thank God that I'm not dead. I'm not dead by now. And every quality that Ruth had, my wife has it. I want to also cite the example of um, um, Esther. Esther whom God used to deliver Israel. Um, this woman, Mary Omogoyega, she is another Esther in my family because God used her to deliver, you know, members of my family from all sorts of backwardness. And in fact, in the war that I've been fighting, the war, to exterminate poverty from my life, this woman, you know, contributed immensely to making it happen. And today we give glory to God. Through this woman, uh, the Lord has elevated people, not only from the family, but from all walks of life. You can imagine, as a man, you say, let us help somebody that you never met before. And your wife agrees. That is very rare. Only a good woman, a God-sent woman can do it. Today, she is a testimony of that kind of thing. Not one, not two, that today uh, God has used her. She has been my encourager. She has been somebody, no matter the vision I bring in, she's always there to support me. And today, I celebrate you beautiful woman. And when you talk of normal beauty in life, my wife possesses two beauties. Beauty or in the physical, that is, it is true that beauty is in the eyes of the beholder. But I've not seen 
a woman anywhere in the world more physically beautiful than my wife, Mary Oredola Omogboyega. She's fantastic. Every day, like I always say, you read my autobiography, I did say that she is a woman whose face brightens my day, you know, inspires me, endears my heart, and she's somebody that anytime even I see her, I am joyful. You can imagine, not only that, the second beauty she had is beautiful of character, beauty in character. Those are these two things that a woman needs, to be beauty in character. She, when you talk of physical beauty, she's not comparable. When you talk of beauty in character, you can imagine a woman who will tolerate everybody in this world, especially even the husband, her, this husband's house, the, her own relatives, then people that you don't know from diaspora, from everywhere, you know, you just, you know, I'm such a man that is restless. Let's, put, let's say that I see the whole world as my friend. And you bring people home and she just, you know, takes care of them. And she, today she makes me proud. I'm very grateful to God for her life. And I want to thank her publicly now that she's been there for us. She allowed me to live the kind of, indeed, her vision joined with my own. So that the Bible says, uh, the people, two, two cannot stay together unless they agree. We are agreed. We are compatible. Everything works well for us. That is why today, and I thank God, we all had worked in our careers and we come back, we retired and we are at peace and we are now watching the children in the play in the, the playground of life, you know, going into their own um, voyage of life. And I know that the Lord had made us to navigate that journey and arrive successfully. They too will even arrive better than us in Yahushua's name. Mm -hmm. Then the third thing that um you know she's seen now she's now uncomfortable. We will soon round up. Eh? <laughs> so the uh, third thing that she has, which endeared me to her, that one is from the book of Proverbs. The Bible tells about the qualities of a, a virtuous or a good woman, you know, enterprising. This lady, if I, I met her uh, in the process of being hardworking, and when she finally joined me till today, she remains hardworking. She is humble. Eh? She's humble to a fault. Number two, she is uh, um, people um, magnetic, magnetic or something. That is, she draws people rather than repel people. And not only, uh, I know a lot of people, a lot of couples that have met us and will say, ah, we want to be like your family. May God help us to be like your family. It's fantastic. I give glory to God that that one also happened. And, um, sorry, uh, that that one also happened and it's a great testimony. So, Mommy, I'm proud of you. I continue to be proud of you even uh, all the time because you gave me peace. You gave me joy. You don't let me have a period to regret in my life. So thank you very much. And Bible says her children calls her blessed. That's who you are. Yesterday was a great wonder. Even in your children from, I mean biological, non-biological, your children from home, your whole children far away, they all gathered yesterday to celebrate you. Your families, I mean from my side and from your side, that means that, you know, you are still very closely knitted. I thank God. That's what I want. And then, and then your the biological children, everybody rallied around yesterday to celebrate you. Uh, you deserve more. And I cannot even do it. It is God. And people generally that the Lord will use to bless you. All I know is that you are a blessed woman. And, uh, bye.
You started well, you will end well in mm. your righteous name. Mm. And as the Lord God Almighty lives, we are now independent, even of the children. So we shall enjoy our independence together for a long time mm. in your righteous name. Then I want to seize this opportunity to appreciate every one of you from my family, from her family, that is from the Omogo Egas, from the Anyide's family, from near and far, from among friends, from neighbors, those of you who have never you know, helped us, our in-laws, wonderful in-laws, here and there, we are very grateful. I see God that you celebrate this woman with us. And then Ubuayi, every one of you that gathered money together, gifts everybody uh, that gathered money together, gifts together to put what happened yesterday mm -hmm. together. And, I mean, she's somebody that doesn't like flamboyancy. Even that yesterday, uh, it would have gone to make noise. Oh, no, but she doesn't. And so we marked it the way she wanted it. And uh, I know what is more important is uh, to give glory to God. Birthday celebration is not to cause problems. So we thank God that uh, that is moderate enough and is acceptable to her. I pray that she will celebrate many more uh, birthdays on earth in Yehoshua's name. Mm -hmm. Now, um, uh, those of you, I didn't mention names because I didn't want to have the problem of um, omitting anybody. So let me say to every one of you, as we saw all the songs, we saw all the best wishes, we saw all the gifts, we saw all the good, good things that follow to encourage her. I pray joy shall never cease from your families, from you and your families in your Yahushua. And as the Lord is helping us to coast this um, ocean successfully, your own homes, you shall have good testimonies. Olori and Omoyi have good testimonies. Olori and Oyayi, you have good testimonies. Olori and Ebi, you have good testimonies. So, uh, I say thank you all very much. Like I said, pardon me for not mentioning names. I will meet somebody and I won't be happy about it. And what do you say, mommy? Thank you all. God bless you. God will continually love and bless you all. Just as she has said, so shall it be for every one of you in Yahushua's name. God bless you. I am proud of her. Mm. <laughs> Hallelujah. Thank you. God bless you. <laughs>